Now, we turn to international diplomacy. U.S. Ambassador Nicholas Burns is once again getting iced out of Chinese social media. The latest instance marks the third time Byrd's statements have been removed from social media in his counselor country after he took the position in April. He responded to it in a recent Twitter post, saying the PRC ought to allow the Chinese people to see what American leaders say, as the American people hear what Chinese leaders say. PRC is short for the People's Republic of China, the country's formal name. Some of Burns' earlier posts were deleted from Weibo and WeChat, two major social platforms in China that both have hundreds of millions of monthly active users. As for what Burns has said in the now-deleted posts, one shared a link to details about the NATO Military Alliance Summit. Two others mentioned comments from the White House and the U.S. State Department related to the 25th anniversary of Hong Kong's return to China. Similar social media deletions tied to other U.S. officials have also happened repeatedly. Secretary of State Antony Blinken's speech on U.S. policy towards China earlier this year faced a blanket ban on Chinese social media. Those statements against his speech from Chinese officials were widely spread across the country. What's more, the official account of the U.S. Consular General in Shanghai got entirely shut down on Weibo in 2012. 